Where did you come out of? Yeah, go on. Go back to where you came from. Day three with the Ramat and today I'm heading into the Schlievahi Mountains which are kind of between Clare and Galway on the southeast uh, border of County Galway and the northeast uh, uh, border of County Clare. Um, really getting into the swing of things here with the Ramat, really starting to enjoy it because it's going, it goes extremely well, absolutely flyer. And uh, I can't, I can't see any problems with it. Okay, it's a little bit. I'm leaning a little bit too far forward, but it's not a huge problem. From here in Crushin, um up through those mountains, um, up into Loch Ray, I think I'll go through Loch Ray. Uh, very easy, get through Loch Ray, and then I'll head back and swing for Kinvara uh, into the burn and end up back in Crushine again which is at the southern edge of the burn and uh, apart from uh, the Schlievahi that's where the climbs are going to be today um, the legs are improving and um, I'll get that out of the way nice and quick and after that it'll be it'll be it, it won't be severe so easy enough day I think really you know so we'll get going all right, how's it going? So far the going is very up and down. I didn't realize it would be as hilly as this. And it's going to get a little bit hillier. Hey buddy. This is well and truly now inside in the middle of the Schlievahis. And this is the way it is. Absolute wilderness. Nobody here. Been stopped here on this road for the last 10 minutes, having a sandwich and nobody has passed. <sighs> Utter isolation. And for another maybe five or six Ks, that's the way it's going to be. That's good. And the climbing seems to be done as well. Just looks like I'm running across the top here. A little bit up and down, but no climbs. Heading for uh, Loch Ray. This appears to be the top. And what have you? Uh, Roscommon, maybe Longford, looking all the way up along there to maybe Leash, Hills and Tipperary here, yeah Hills and Leash here, probably Kildare, you can see as far as, ah that's unreal.
just a quick stop here to see how's my tower doing. Hmm, gearbox doesn't sound too good. Yeah, still got a couple of degrees lean. I think it's safe enough for another while. Doesn't appear to be any worse. That was a brilliant day today, not least because trying out the new saddle and it worked. I don't have that pain this evening, you know, right up there in that middle area where things tend to get a little bit uncomfortable um, at around the 70 or 80 K mark. I just don't have that this evening, which now that's a plus. Now, because it's a new saddle, I do have a little bit of tenderness on, on, on the two tailbones, tailbone, whatever you want to call it. And, um, but that's only to be expected with a new saddle, but I don't have that problem, you know, like I say, right there in the middle, where that really uncomfortable feeling comes from. And it really knocks the good out of out of out of everything and this evening I was feeling great at 1780k and all the way back here so yeah um, the day started off into straight into some really up and down countryside and couldn't really make any great headway and then into tougher countryside um, over the Schlebohys and once I hit Loch Grey, that all sorted itself out because it was plain sailing all the way up to Kinvera and from Kinvera then down to Crusheen. So yeah, um, like I say, big day with the saddle, got a lot of information on that, good information and uh, good data and uh, hopefully now um, tenderness like I say on my two tailbones uh, on, on the tail the hips I'm, I'm sure that will that will adjust but uh, yeah so right time to get out of Crusheen thanks for watching catch you again